Howdy dorks! How's it going? Happy Monday! Happy Unchowder! Happy New Door Fortress Fortress Day! Again, we've been having a couple of those recently, haven't we? Um, also a new cat cam. Hey! <laughs> we can make eye contact with each other while she's in the cat cam. That hasn't happened before. She has a she has a whole perch now. I'm glad she's found it. She just found it for the first time like five minutes ago. Uh, Cause it's new, cause I just set it up today. So now instead of being tucked in behind our monitors, she's perched up above our monitors. So like if I, I can almost touch her. I can, uh, yeah. <laughs> Hi, how's it going? Yeah, she'll, she will happily ignore me up there forever. Um, I think that looks okay, right? There's a bit of light in there. You can kind of see that there's just a, a fluff void in there. That's all you're ever going to see. <laughs> anyway, um, playing Dwarf Fortress. Because of course we are. And I have new shinies. Check out my new shinies. I went on an adventure and I have acquired more shinies. This is not all of them. I acquired a couple of them. Um, I'm just not wearing them all at once because most of them are necklaces. I need to find more rings. The Goodwill did not have many rings. Uh, they had a bunch of necklaces and a handful of, uh, of bracelets. Uh, so I have more necklaces. It's, it's mostly even, right? Yeah, I like this one though. Um, it's it's shiny and and leaf adjacent, I guess. I don't know. I like it. Um, oh, I didn't, and I didn't restart the challenge thing, so there's not a community challenge for today because you have accomplished it. Hooray! I'll 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 remake it for for next time. Um, but yeah, our job for today is we're gonna start a new door fortress, and we are going to attempt to reach Metropolis as quickly as possible which is the same thing that we've done for the last two things, last two fortresses. Um, but I'm gonna go about it a, a little differently this time, right? Um, so hatchet net we did in like just a touch over five years. And then we just completed, uh, but what was its name? I don't know why that one, the, the fortress that we just finished didn't, didn't have a catch, catchy name. They can't all be winners. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, check out, check out the new shinies and the new cat cam, I guess. I, can't, I point that way, but physically she's right there. Um, uh, yeah, so in... Uh, uh, what was it called? Oh my god. It's gonna bug me. I, I know you don't care, but it's gonna bug me uh, if I don't, don't look it up now. Uh, come on. Here. And then... Here. Faded Sling. There we go. Faded Sling. We we did Faded Sling in a touch over three years. And I want to beat that. That's our PB. Three years. Three years in like a month is our is our PB currently. And we did that by making a whole bunch of instruments and crafts and goblets and, you know, just using everything, making everything and having a very varied fortress industry. Um, but this time, I want to focus. I want to do the opposite. I want to do just food. I want to do. I want to see if we can reach Metropolis as fast as possible, and all of our wealth is going to come from food. And I want to see how that compares, because I'm I'm quite curious. I really want to see how this is going to work out. Um, because yeah, uh, I guess we'll. We'll see how it works and we'll go over some details as we go. Um, today's episode is brought to you by butterflies. Uh, almost as important as bees, quite important. Uh, like maybe, maybe typically second string compared to bees, but just as important as bees and just as pretty, I think. Uh, but also by you, clicking those buttons down there, um, spamming the badger emote. Look at our new badger emote. Uh, and, uh, and you know, joining the discord, all that good stuff. Um, that's, that's, that's what we're doing. So, hooray. Uh, let's just go over here. la -di da Um, and we're gonna embark. I, I have already, I've been fiddling around in here just a touch. I did a, a couple of searches for places that I think will be appropriate. Um, and I've chosen our origin civilization, right? Yes, thank you. I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna forget this time. We are gonna be the same Civ. There's all of our other things. Oh, she's gonna leave? No, she's just gonna... Oh, she's gonna come here. That way. 
I guess that makes sense. I guess I can't blame her for doing that. That's not what I intended, but whatever. She's just gonna, she, she jumped over a monitor and into the area in front of me. Neat. Um, anyway, we're embarking and the th I have some notes as far as what I'm looking for in an embark. And it mostly amounts to vegetation, right? Um, I'm thinking, and I was looking around, I think we're gonna come down here. I'm, I'm wanting something that is adjacent to a savanna and near grasslands, which is kind of all this down here, right? This is, this is shrubland, savanna, shrubland, savanna, um, and then grassland. I say, here's down, down here's grassland, and then there's a bunch of like wastelands in here too. Um, but most of this is pretty, pretty vegetative. Um, the, the savannas themselves aren't because that's how savannas work. But what I, I think what I'm looking for, we can come in here, right? Um, here, this is, so this is wasteland. I don't want to be on wasteland, but this is, here's shrubland and here's savanna. So I think I want to have an embark that's like kind of grassland, kind of shrubland, but then also kind of forest. Because we're going to get a lot of food from our vegetation and our trees, I think is what's going to happen. Um, like here, that that's all, that's wasteland. This is, this is savanna. This is shrubland. I'm looking, so I, I did a search for two by two squares. And then I'm going to embark into a four by four to make it bigger. That's the idea here. This is all, so like here, here's grassland. Ward mean, <laughs> okay. Um, but then here's like a heavily forested and thickly vegetated untamed wilds, which is exactly what we want. Um, I think maybe here. I think, right? Cause then, cause we have, we have soil, we have clay, we have an aquifer, we have iron, we have flux, and that's all I care about. We're going to be doing steel for our defensive people so that we can have like gear and not get annihilated by goblins. But, um, I'm not going to do the platinum. I'm not going to do the gold. I'm barely even going to care about our gems, right? We're, we're going to be making food almost exclusively, um, like as much as possible. So I think what we're going to do, I don't really care about the wasteland, right? And then this is all, it's all grassland. Is there, is there a savanna nearby? I'd love to have like savanna and trees. I wonder if that's a thing that can even happen. Cause this is all, this is all shrubland. A little bit of wasteland in between. But here's like savanna. Let's see, I don't know why like here registered is okay, but here did not. I don't see much of a difference. Uh, Cause we could do like here, right? Uh, this is skirt banks, the the stream, and then it meets up with, oh, it's all skirt banks. Okay. Fair enough. Um, yeah, temperate, temperate savanna and temperate conifer forest. Why don't I do that? Why don't I do that? The shrubland is still like woodland. Maybe sh I mean, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. On here, this is Savannah, right? Yeah, here we go. Here we go. What about this? Flash boat? The stream? It's got all the things. It's, it's got all the things. Let's try there. Let's try there. And we're going to do a 4x4. Four four. So I'm thinking like this. Right? So that half of our... Like the north half is going to be in the forest and the south half is going to be in savanna. And then we can, in theory, get some nice creatures coming in from the savanna. But then also have all the resources that come in from the forest. I think that's what I'm going to do. Um, we are going to have soil. We are going to have clay. Uh, we're having an aquifer, but we've had an aquifer in every single fortress so far. I think this is what we're doing. I think this is what we're doing. Uh, we have a light aquifer. 
and we have a savage area that's cool i want those i want both those things um i'm going to prepare carefully and now we we did our, our profile last time but i'm even gonna do like it's gonna be different again uh realistically and then why can't i come on excel Well, let's let's start with this, and then we can make we can we're just gonna modify it, right? Um, hello, hello, hello! Welcome, welcome! We are embarking. We are embarking to a new a new place. Um, now, yeah, if I feel like I should have just whatever. Uh, okay, so number one. Number one is going to be an appraiser and stone carver instead of an appraiser and miner so that we don't accidentally kill our <laughs> our um our appraiser. Hi friend, we'd love a new embark. Hello, 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 thank you. Um yeah, embarks are great, right? Fresh uh just a brand new clean slate to kill all our dwarves on. Okay, I want stone carver, right? One, two, three, four, five. And then your is your other thing appraiser? Is that what you actually have in here? Proficient appraiser. Okay. And then number two, I want you to be a miner and a carpenter. Is how that shook out. Uh, what are, what are you currently? I forget what I made them last time. Yeah. Uh, oh. You're... You have all these things still. Strange. Uh, so you are... Miner and Carpenter. Got it. And then you... Are Miner... And Mechanic. Is that the smart thing to do? I don't know, but that's what we're doing. Surely mechanic is a crucial skill. Is it not? I think mechanic is a crucial skill. Ah, oh, there it is. And then number four is going to be our record keeper and organizer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay, and then do 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 the uh, record keeper and organizer, and then here's gonna be our farmer person. You're gonna be a planter and an herbalist. Planter and. Herbalist is in here? No, is it, it's not? Okay, there we go. Herbalist. Um, and then you're gonna be our fisher. You're currently a hunter, so I'll leave you, because we're gonna have a fisher and a hunter. Um, a proficient ambusher, I think. Or no, that is, that is the fishing thing, right? So then I want you also to be a fighter. Yeah, perfect. And then you are going to be kind of the same thing. Instead of stone crafter, you're going to be a fisher. What's your other th what's your other thing? You're not not a record keeper. You are a fighter. Cool. So now we have uh, our our appraiser is also a stone carver. We have two miners who have some other skills. We have our administrator, who's record keeper and organizer. We have a farmer, a fisher, and a hunter. I think that makes sense. Um, and I'm going to save this as Metro V2 food. Save. Um, oh, but the other thing is we want animals. Animals. 
Um, one thing that I'm curious about is what is the cheapest animal that can be milked? Because all the values for like what to get for things on Embark is not on the wiki. Um, I, I would have had to have come all the way here just to find these values. Um, so donkeys are 101, horses are 101, cows are 150, uh, lambs, lambs are 50. Um, so I know sheep and goats and pigs are kind of my, my guesses. Like goats? Oh man, goats are only 26. Perfect. Uh, and then goose, llama, alpaca. I just want whatever's cheapest, and I think it's going to be goats. Like the the adults and the children are the same cost, which is interesting. But you know, okay. It's gotta. It's gonna be goats. It's gonna be the goats. And now she's like underneath, under the cat stuff. Um, okay, so then instead of cows, like, instead of two cows, how about we do a bunch of goats? Where'd they go? Um, so then we're gonna do, like, a billy goat, and then three nanny goats? Right? Even that's cheaper than, yeah, let's do, like, let's do like that. Get a bunch of goats and milk all of them. Um, we're going to have a hunting dog and two cats. I think that makes sense. We could even get like a second, a second hunting dog. Well, let's do, let's do, let's keep the one hunting dog. Those are they're not that expensive, actually. Um, I also want some egg layers. So we have chickens are, are good, obviously. So our ducks. Gooses? They all cost the same. I wonder what's best. I assume... I mean, if a turkey costs the same as a duck, I'm gonna take a turkey. Uh, so we'll do like one, one gobbler and like... five hens. Why not? Um, and then as far as items go, uh, these, these is all still kind of the default, right? Uh, we got our we got our two picks. We got our battle axes. We have some starting food. Um, one thing that I've learned. So I was reading on the wiki. One thing that I've learned is that you can you there is a little bit of cheese to be had on the embark screen here, which I didn't know about before, which is kind of exciting. Um, but if we go down here to uh, like for instance, let's find milk. Just gonna be drinks. No. Is it an extract? Yeah, okay. Um, so there's all these kinds of milk for all these different kinds of animal, right? There, you can have a donkey milk, you can have a horse milk, you can have a cow's milk. But the game doesn't want to mix the cow's milk with the sheep's milk. So each one of these different kinds of milk gets its own barrel. And on Embark, it's free. You, it just, the Embark just gives you a barrel to handle the milk that you're buying. So if we do this, if we go one donkey milk, one horse milk, one cow milk, one sheep milk, one pig's milk, one goat's milk, like that, blam, 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 we're going to get that many barrels for free. For one, like we're getting the milk for one point each, and we're going to get that many barrels. How about that? Um, same thing with the the food. Um, like obviously we could get way more than we need, but like with the meat here, it all costs two. It also works for sand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was getting there. Um, you can do it with food, and you can do it with sand. Um, you you buy a sand and you get a bag, and we're definitely gonna want bags because we are going to be making um, like flour and stuff. Um, so, which is funny because I don't care about the sand at all. Um, do we even have a way of like emptying the sand out of the bag? Are we gonna have to make glass stuff just to empty the bags? That would be kind of funny. Uh, but we can, we can do this. Just, yeah, that'll give us that many bags for free. Uh, and I'm, I'm happy with that. I'm good with that. 
Um, and then we can also do like meat and fish. And these are all two each. Do, 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 do. Or maybe plants. Let's look at, can we see what are plants at? Oh, just, just the plump helmets. Got it. Okay. Uh, but we could do, let's do that. And then, and like, I think, so like all of the wombat stuff could go in one, one barrel. So I think what I want to do, wombat meat plus wolverine meat or great hound arrow meat, I guess. Wolverine or wolverine kidney, sure, whatever. Dingo intestines and worm meat. All right, skunk meats. Prepared ant brain, of course. Delicious. Louse brain. Crow meat. Like all of those are gonna give us. Like we don't need we don't need 15. Prepared great horned owl kidney. Uh yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna add a bunch of things here. Oh, some of these are expensive. Why are jabberers so expensive? Okay, sure. Uh, bug bat, sure. Yeah, some of these are more expensive than others. Good to know. All meat. Prepared giant mole kidney, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna say that that's probably fine, and then we can round this out with... Uh, not much. A cat. Or how about just more more turkey hens? There we go. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think. And then yeah, we're gonna save this as as that. Yeah. So we're right. And I'm. Am I missing anything? I think that's what we're doing here. I think that's it. Okay, uh, I'm gonna hit the embark button and regret whatever I'm forgetting. Uh, I am ready. Look at all my goats! So because we are going to be... Not dependent on, but we want to keep these goats alive, right? Uh, we don't want a giant Kia running off with our goats. So I'm gonna want to get them inside. Uh, but that means we're going to have to pierce a uh, a cave pretty quick so that we can start to get those uh, those cave the our our indoor pasture to start overgrowing with moss and stuff uh, so we can make sure that they stay alive and stuck and junk. Uh, but here we are. You have arrived after a journey from the mountain homes into the forbidding wilderness beyond your harsh track has finally ended. Uh, this is the same each time, uh, but a new chapter of Dwarven history begins here at this place. Logum Cadem, paint channeled. Strike the earth. Um, and I'm going to pause because uh, we have some things to do first. But look, we are we're just all goats and turkeys. I love it. Um, and then we have we have a river going like right down the middle. This is this is cool. And look, this is we have a whole four x four embark. When was the last time we've done this? We have so many resources here. We're gonna pick this place clean. We got these giant ginkgo trees. We got hazel. We got bayberries again. We got almonds. A lot of this uh, similar. Uh, some of the usual suspects here. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be making, we're gonna be going nuts with our nuts. Perfect. Um, and there's gonna be willow along all of these. Like willow always grows right next to the water, which is great because you chop down the tree and it all shows up, it all goes into the water. The willow is always cool that way. Um, oh, but I want to see, I was hoping to see a whip vine. Tree saplings, white millet, garlic. Walnut sapling, cranberry, ratweed. I forget what it even looks like. Lentils. And beans. Got some beans. Uh, 
but yeah, you can't really, you can't really say like, I want to embark to a place that has whip vine intentionally, right? You kind of have to just happen upon it. And we happened upon it with base earths, but I haven't seen it since. I was kind of hoping it would show up here, but maybe not. Maybe we'll get lucky. I feel like I would have seen it by now. There's prickleberries and, and such, and yeah, okay. Well, that's fine. We don't need whip vine. It would just be nice to have, right? Are we have like millet? We can make flour of millet. Oh, uh, chicory? Cool. Yeah, Alright, and then a colony of ants. Good. Cool, cool, cool. So now, first off. I'm going to chop some trees before we even unpause. Um, I'm thinking our, our entrance is just going to be central here. We have damp clay loam on our first level. Probably all the way up here, yeah. Um, and yeah, it's it definitely fewer trees down on the south side. I think, but there's like plenty in the middle, right? So yeah, we'll... We could just make our fort up here. I don't know. It don't really matter. I'm going to say it stays central. We're going to stay down here. So I'm just going to make a tree cutting designation just right here. Um, clear, clear a little space for ourselves and get some initial uh, wood going. Um, and then we probably need to go into our labor and say someone is a woodcutter. You are a woodcutter. We have our two miners, uh, we have our hunter, we have our fisher, perfect. And then plant gatherer, everybody does this. I'm actually going to say just our farmer person is going to be a plant gatherer for now because uh, everyone else is going to have jobs to do. And then our expedition leader is important and needs to not go anywhere dangerous. Uh, so you're just going to be a, a furniture hauler mostly. Um, okay, so then there's there's tree chopping. I'm gonna make a plant gathering zone, which is this. Let's zoom out a little bit. Um, we're obviously gonna have to build some rivers over, or build some bridges over our river, uh, but that's fine. I'm gonna say that this is our plant gathering area, uh, and then we need a fishing zone. We don't need a fishing zone, but I'm going to make a fishing zone. Uh, we can do fishing in these little ponds here. Uh, but we can also fish along the river. Let's do it like that. It's probably good. They don't. We don't want our fish going too far abroad quite yet. Um, I'm going to make a surface pasture zone just so that our, our goats don't wander off too far. Um, so we're just gonna do we're just gonna do like this, and then it's just all these goats. I'm even gonna put our um, our turkeys in there just so that they don't wander off too far, like get eaten by a dingo or something. Oh, uh, we still have we still ended up with a buffalo and a donkey. Is that because of the wagon? I wonder. Well, either way, um, they'll just go in there, and then I'm gonna make a wood stockpile. And it's just gonna go like literally right there. For wood. And then uh, oh we should we should set our our hunting dog to be with our hunter. Uh, right, so we're gonna assign you to the hunter. Perfect. And then what else? And then what else? I think that's everything I have written down here. Fishing zone, pasture zone, oh, refuse and corpse stockpile. Those those can be important early on. Um, we're gonna go a little bit out here, but we'll say this is refuse. And this is for corpses. And then I'm gonna say our our stairwell. Our, our initial dig down is going to happen right here. Yeah, let's go. Let's go right here. Why not? 
I think this will work. And we're just going to go down. We're going to probably find a cave and probably find a aquifer. And that's exactly what I want. Um, I'm even going to say miners are only miners. Everyone else is good. Okay. Are we good? I'm going to... I think we're good. I'm going to unpause. Tally ho. Yeah, they're just going to go for it. Cool. Um, and then we're... We got clay loam. And then you're already... You've already found damp stone. Hooray! Found the aquifer. Oh my god. Well, let's let's get through it now. That's that's what we're doing. Not not procrastinating. We're we're digging. We're just digging down. And like, look, we've already got. Okay, and now we're down to to stone at least. Did that. Do. Cool. Got tetrahedrite and shirt and kalanite. And then I think we're through the aquifer itself. That was very, that was a very sh shallow aquifer, if that's the case. Not that I'm complaining. Yeah, they're, they're going for it. Okay. Oh, more, more damn stone. Yeah, perfect. I knew we weren't going to get that lucky. Uh, and there's the cave. Perfect. That is what I like to see. And then this is all like all aquifer. Okay. Shadow or I'm a break rule three by not going to sleep on time. <laughs> Who needs sleep? Who needs sleep? Um, also, hi, welcome. Um, we are starting a new fortress. We are finding a cave. And then again, our f I th we broke the first cave. The first cave in our world is broken. <laughs> I don't know why, um, but it's fine, you know. Um, yeah, okay. So first off, yeah, it's all mud. And it doesn't, it's not gonna like grow, it's not gonna make our, um, it's not gonna make our, our dirt grow moss and stuff. Uh, so then this is gonna do all I'm seeing is perfect farmland. I mean, we are here for farming um, That is a thing we are here to do Okay, and then I'm gonna say How do I how do I do this I want to make I want to make a drain uh, well, There's like lignite and stuff in here, too. Maybe we just go to the side and we just do this. Maybe we just do this. Um, and I'm going to construct a floor over here just to seal it off for the moment. And yeah, this is all going to be aquifer. Hip hip hooray. Uh, but then we're going to go like to here, I guess. And then we're going to drain out like that. And then this will give us a way to go down further when we want to. Yes, yes. My goodness. <laughs> and, then, and then, yeah, okay. I decided to make an underground fully sieve, and the farms are so basically cliffside farmlands. Uh, there. Of small size, because the map gen effed me in the maps making. Yeah, that's fair. I mean, it is, it is what it is, isn't it? Uh, okay, and then... I mean, there's a, I mean, yeah, look at all this. And then we're just going to draw, uh, oh, it's all aquifer too. So we can irrigate this quite easily, right? Maybe we're going to build in here. Maybe this is going to be our, our cave fortress. Okay. So now I want to smooth. Uh, 
Uh, the giant hedgehog is fighting. That didn't take long. The giant head hedgehog rolls into a ball. Neat. Okay. Uh, do we have anything else? We have we have sturgeons. We have sturgeons. Well, those are probably worth something, right? And giant hedgehogs and giant kestrels. Cool. And sea lampreys. Neat. Um, I guess I, we're gonna be fishing out sturgeons. Cliffside farms overlooking a vast drop into water sounds really nice. I mean, that does sound nice. Um. And so far in this world, our our cave one stuff has been relatively flat. So I'm kind of expecting the same here. Um, I'm seeing, yeah, I'm seeing like a bunch of like big open, open patches. Am I allowed to just straight up build on these? What if I do farm plot? Yeah, okay, so we can just straight up build on this mud. We're gonna be farming down here. We're gonna be doing nothing but farming down here. Perfect. Um, okay, and then we wanna do fortifications. And now we won't drown. Just gonna add fences, cause dwarf be dwarf. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah, don't let them, don't let them dodge down the cliff sides. Um, I'm gonna say, this is gonna be like our temporary space, right? Um, this is what we do each time. We're just gonna do a big space like this. And then probably also like this for our, our pasture. We just wanna get our stuff inside now. And the, the hedgehog is fighting. Apparently it rolling into a ball counts as fighting. Terrified while in conflict. <laughs> but look at the sprite! Oh my god. <laughs> I kind of like the I, I really like the giant hedgehog. And it's not being aggressive or anything. I think it's just scared. Um, oh, of course, this is all gonna be... No, that's not what I meant. There's more... Oh, just because they're under the... They're just under the thing. This isn't aquifer, it's just... It's just under a pond, whatever. <laughs> Who's fighting? Giant Hedgehog! Like, apparently... It rolling into a ball and unrolling goes into the combat log. So there's a giant hedgehog up here that's just, you know, hanging out with the goats, but panicking and rolling into a ball and unrolling. I think it's just, yeah, overcome with terror. What's our hunter doing? I, I, I kind of wish our hunter would actually take care of it. No job. We can hunt. We probably don't have bolts. I wish there was a feature to ignore damp stone. I agree. I wish I could say ignore this damp stone in particular. Uh, okay, so we're gonna make a big ol' stockpile. And that's gonna be for like everything except for those and except for wood. Everything else though, I think I just went in there. And then we're gonna disassemble our wagon, and then people should get going on on putting that stuff down there. Nothing to catch in the central swaps. That's fair. Wish I could make my archers actually actually quit bolts. Um, it's gotten better recently. I know that there was one uh, like patch, like even within the last couple of months or even weeks even. That was specifically about bolts. Um, but I just find that if you, it, they just kind of do it eventually. If you keep them, uh, like, on a schedule, um, they'll, they'll eventually figure it out. Uh, it just, it, just, it takes them a minute. Definitely takes them a minute. Uh, okay, so I definitely want, like, a still. And I'm going to, I guess I'm going to select. We probably have some stones, right? Sounds like an echidna doing the same thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and then I want a butcher. And basically, I want everything. 
Alright, I want a tanner because we're going to kill things that can be tanned. Yes, to... Yes, a minute to pick up one bull and fight an ancient demon. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Well, once they figure it out, once they've done it, like once they've gone on and off like training duty a number of times, they'll have a full quiver, in my experience at least. Um, and then when you need to give them like an actual go fight a thing order, they should they should have it. But I mean, they're they're very not consistent about it, in my experience. Uh, but they're better than they used to be. Can I make a fishery? I don't think I made a fishery. Uh, and then, yeah, see, this isn't going to grow. Nothing in the first cave is going to grow for whatever reason. Um, so I even want to just... I'm going to keep digging. We're going to go all the way down to cave 2, if we can. i do this. Why not? Oh goodness, look at cave one just going. Okay, that's cool and all. Um, how far do you think the aquifer goes though? I mean, it seems to go... Okay, I'm gonna do that. And then I'm just gonna do like a little side path and that's gonna be how, how we drain... How we drain that aquifer section. I think that's all of it, right? Oh. Cool. And then yeah, they're gonna they're gonna whine about this all the way down. Yeah, it's going. It's filling too fast. No, it's too much. Can I... I don't know if I can smooth it that fast. Uh... And then that it didn't even. Okay, I'm being real weird about it. And then let's let's just dig to the side like this. And don't do that. Yeah, see it already filled. My God. Jeez. Yeah, you need. Hmm. Oh, and then now I can't. Wasn't smart. Yay, more shinies! Oh, did it? I thought it was finished. Hmm. For some, why did I think it was finished? Anyway, uh, yay, more shinies. Here, th these are the new shinies. Uh, that's why legendary steel-plated spearmen will always be good. Yeah, no kidding. I mean, melee is just there's no there's really no substitute to a good active melee squad. Uh, while well, a necromancer is entombed in the most fancy ass house underwater. The whole farm library. Yeah, no kidding. Um, how would you personally go about setting up a dry moat so your dwarves can escape it? I was thinking about doing it where you put an entrance in the bottom into the fort that is closed off my walls, but would that work? Hmm. I'm not entirely sure what you mean by a dry moat. Where you put it? so just like a just a pit like a ringed pit. We you put an entrance in the bottom into the fort, just closed closed off by walls. Basically, a ringed pit around the fort. I mean, why not? Uh, most things won't voluntarily jump into a pit. Like even if something can survive falling into a pit, most things won't like jump into a pit. They'll like try to climb down if anything. Um, so it would be a good deterrent, I think. I'm already gonna be screwing up this, uh... I'm already screwing up. Let's... You really do need it to be like... 
like a two by two and so like this is too small so can we where can we try this we could do here kind of yeah let's do that This is even going to be like our, our entrance into the cave, probably? Let's just... let's... okay, well, let's, let's ignore this. Okay, let's try that. Let's see if that's any... if we're any more successful here. I know. <sighs> Luckily, they're just right here. to roll three and go sleep okay have a good night yeah thanks for dropping by um we'll be doing this for a bit yeah thank you <laughs> more shinies never enough shinies okay and then here i think here we're gonna do like a side path to kind of drain out a little bit, because, oh my god. Did it 100% though, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Very nice, thank you. Okay. And that'll help us not drown. Oh, it's even... There's not even aquifer over here. Perfect. Okay. So then, yeah, we're gonna keep going down. Um, like, I'm sure our, our other people probably need work already. Um, I should be putting in jobs for... Uh, for this. Um, but let's do... Okay, so let's do a meeting area. Even to say... Or no, that's gonna... That would be silly. Let's do meeting area here. Except... It's just a generic meeting area, um, and then we're gonna have a pasture here, and just hope that it will someday have stuff in it. Um, and then our stockpile can get bigger. But now, uh, oh, posture check. Yeah, that's an important one. <laughs> um. Yes, I'm gonna put in some work orders, uh, even just to just for food and stuff, just to keep them busy. No, not that button. Why was it? Why was that the button my brain pushed? Uh, oh, we need a manager, of course. Okay, yeah, let's do. Let's do that. Let's do here, and here. Those are our <laughs> little offices, right? I'm even going to say, let's say, here is going to be F5. And then, yeah, they're just, they're going to keep hitting Aquifer all day long. There we go. And there's even, oh, that's Jet. I was kind of, I was going to say, oh, yeah, coal, but it's not coal. It's Jet. Um, that's fine. Then we're gonna we're gonna keep going down. We're gonna keep going down. I want the deep stuff. Please and thank you. Oh my God. Is 
This is my life. Oh, are we are we through it? Not really. Okay. And see, it's already up to three. That's ridiculous. Come on. Hurry up. Okay. That was close. Once it gets to fours, you're kind of out of luck. They will they will not go into a four. Um, and then we could do like... Like that. Even. Oh, because I just continued the same stair. That's right. What you should do is you, sh you should do little dog legs, dog legs like this, but you... You're like when you go down from here, you go down over here instead of right here because now all the all the water up here is just still going down into here That's what you do. So now Now instead of these Whatever um, Now we're gonna go down over here Uh, geez, I'm surprised that we like revealed that much of the cave. We should be pretty close to the bottom of the aquifer, right? We might even be through the aquifer with this. Yeah, okay. They're just going to go for it. Perfect. Perfect. Seeing marble? Okay. Now... Well, like our main, our main stuff here is gonna be. Uh, oh, we need chairs. I need to make like two chairs in order to put in a work order. Stone worker. Um, maybe they can just go, and then let's do. What else do we want? We probably we want a carpenter. Boyer? I don't know that we care about a boyer too much. Uh, but here, we want to do... Roan. One. Two. There we go. Um, and then a, a pair of doors as well. <laughs> door, door. There we go. And then here's that, and then... Yeah. I mean, they got they got there. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna say, let's go down to like... I'm just gonna say negative 100. I'll get something. Um... Still needs a chair. Okay. Make me my chairs, please. I mean, I can even just say... Oh, it requires an empty food storage item. Okay, so we're gonna need, um, need barrels pretty quickly. Barrel. Barrel. on a door. Oh, it's just still in the... It's just still in the thing. That's fine. Um, okay, so this is gonna be an office. Now I'm going to assign it to our expedition leader, right? Is that... Or no, not even. It's, um... Well, it's even gonna be the same person, right? Our organizer and our record keeper is one person. Uh... Is it you? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, cuz... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's who it is. Cuz then I can say manager... 
is also our expedition leader. Roker is our trader. And that's... Oh, and our bookkeeper is our expedition leader. Perfect. Perfect. So we only need... Technically, we only need one office, don't we? Um, right? Because... Because, yeah. Uh, manager and bookkeeper are the only things that need an office, and they're the same person. How about that? So now we can come in here, and we're going to say, make lavish meal. Um, and then that can be... I mean, we'll do it... Four at a time? Um, but this is gonna, it's gonna repeat, like, as long as there's stuff. It's not even gonna care how much food we have. It's just gonna cook food forever. Um, so, solid items. I mean, yeah, how do I... Just unrotten cookable items. Yeah, we'll say like 10. That's fine. So long as there are cookable items, you will cook them. And then same thing with booze. Uh, we're going to... Oh, we should make mead. Should we do a... Should we make mead? We haven't been bothering with mead in our other ones, because it's kind of, you know, whatever. But if we're doing food, then let's, let's do mead. Um, so we're going to do brew drink from plants. And brew drink from fruit. And then same thing. Just going to be a little smaller. And then this repeats as long as there's a storage container. I guess that's important. Uh, not kind is fine. Does not need... Oh, it's just a five. That's fine. And then same thing here. And then let's do barrels. Wooden barrels. Let's not make adamantine barrels. And then this is going to keep an eye on empty barrels and add logs. And then we should do bins. I'm also going to make some wooden bolts just so that we have some uh, logs more than like five and bolts less than 50. I'll give them a start. Oh, and it's we're saving. It's summer. <laughs> Man, seasons are so fast when you're when you're going fast. So we have an aquifer up at the top again, so we can do the same thing with our waterfalls as we did last time and just power them, not power them, uh, we source our water from the aquifer instead of the river. I don't know what's actually better. I also, all these flies, there's nothing in here that's rotting, right? I know this is rotting. Shouldn't be rotting. It's weird. Does food need to be like at a dedicated stockpile? I didn't think it did. Uh, all right. So we are we are clearly digging. We're um, we actually got down to negative a hundred. What the hell? Uh, and clearly we have uh, some water down here. I don't want to lose our ability to go down there. Uh, but let's see. Cave one. Cave one went down pretty far. Down to. 30 something. So let's come down to 50. And I'm going to do just a couple of tunnels. 
the sake of finding our caves. Should be fine. You know what? I'm even gonna say like 40. And 50. Yeah, okay, that's fine. I guess this thing all the way at the bottom should be the highest priority, but yeah, whatever. Uh, it'll be fine. Now, we're still needing things to be moved in. I don't want to give them too much junk to do. Of course, you're not doing anything. Preparing raw fish, okay. I want, I do want this food to get inside before it starts to go bad. Uh, what else does my, my little sheet say? Done all that. Some stockpiles and workshops. We made an everything stockpile. Oh, we should make a dormitory and some beds. I'm not gonna bother doing like individual bedrooms this time. Um, so I'm just gonna make like right now. We're just gonna do ten beds, and then we'll make a room for them. Uh, temp meeting hall. We got that wooden wall. Oh yeah. Okay. And then we can do this part. Left after, yeah, so we're gonna do like this. Uh, make them all out of hazel, why not? Clam. And then we're gonna do a bridge. Goes like this. can do a stair comes up like this and then we'll build a ceiling uh, we are finding lots of things my goodness oh did we actually find a cave you didn't actually tell me uh, oh this is minus 20 so then we've already we've already been down here this is still cave one Holy crap! I've seen some highly vertical caves, but I have not seen Cave 1 be like this. This is ridiculous. Holy cow! Okay, hold on. We need to not be opening up all of these. Uh, okay, so this is all fine. A chasm? Yeah, this, this is a whole ass chasm. Uh, let's get rid of those, and then we'll make a wall here. Whatever. And then come down to here. Same thing. I guess they can they can keep digging. Wow. Okay. Anyone want some cave one? We have some cave one. Okay. Okay, this is negative 80. We're at negative 80 and we're still seeing. Just just don't mind that one, please. Thank you. Okay, cool. This is absurd. I've never seen that. And then there's the bottom. Holy cow! Some migrants have arrived. Hooray! Um, and yeah, we're gonna end up flooding a bit here, uh, but we can even just drain into this cave. Um, goodness. Goodness, goodness.
You just you fell asleep. Okay. <clears throat> Fine. Uh, that all got made. So then let's do a floor like this. It can also be wood. Um, and we should make a mechanic. Um, how many migrants did we get? Well, we're at 11, so we got four. Dang. Uh, but that's fine. You are... Why are you locked to something? A craft dwarf. What are you? I don't see what you're bound to. <laughs> that, I mean, that got to be one of our new people, right? It must have just been a mistake something. Those are big badgers. Uh, giant badger boar. Those aren't even agitated. Those are just big badgers. Those are just big badgers. Oh dear. <laughs> they're, uh, they're quite a bit larger than their, their normal sized counterparts. Gotta say. Um, we do want to build a bridge over there, but I'm thinking we're just gonna let them hang out on that side of the river for the moment. Because that's, that's cool and all. Um, our giant hedgehog is still just right here. Um, are we... We're making all of our stuff. Good, good, good. Um, I'm going to say... We're going to make a dorm. And it's going to be like this. Yeah, I'll just do something like that. Um, I should put in a thing for like doors. Let's do rock door. We don't have any doors. Oh, we have a door. Oh, because I didn't, I didn't have to do that one. That's right. And then this can count as a dorm. Blam. Now we'll have a place to sleep. As meager as it is. No. Gathering plants. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> the hedgehog just ran off. And startled all the goats. Is that what happened? Where'd it go? Yeah. It just ran off. Okay, bye. Uh, but now we have a giant kakapo. Oh, and great horned owls. Good. Our friends. Our favorites. I was just on the ground, too. Strong. It is a strong kakapo. If you say so. Uh, okay. Now... For real, where's... Oh my god. Did we get... Did we get this done? Okay, so then I want to do fortifications just there, and then and then we'll be fine. It's going to fill up to there. That's fine. But then let's do stairs down further. So it's only going to let me go down to 129. We may as well. We're already down this far. Um, but here, I would love to have some of this closed off. Is there a spot in here that would let us just farm on it? Look at all that. My god. 
Do we do we try to wall this off? I mean, I could make a wall here, and it it wouldn't need to be very tall. And then and then we would have a little bit of an entrance here. But I could we could even wall here. And then and then here, this would only need to be too tall. And then over here, these are tall for some reason. Okay. Uh, what we could do like, like here, or even just, I'd probably just go straight across here. And then we have to go up a couple floors, but that's fine. We can do that. So we can we can seal this off without too much trouble. But yeah, um, ultimately, I think we're going to be farming down here. So that's cool. Um, I want to have an entrance that can be kind of defended. Uh, so probably here. Let's do like, I'm even going to say this is lower priority so that other people can do things. Uh, but maybe just like this. Uh, somebody is fighting. Okay, if you say so. Okay. Can someone please move all of the junk? That would be appreciated. We have discovered a cave. And a deep pit. Okay, first of all, cave. Cool. Cave 2, right? Cave moss, yeah. Cool. S Cave 2 starts at 100. Could even be... It might even start at the same level as Cave 1, which I have literally never seen before. Let's go... I mean, that'll be... That's not a priority. I literally just wanted to open this. Uh, so this is all fine. That's fine. You can all stop now. Thank you, you've done the thing. Uh, and then that's, that's fine, and that's fine, so I just want to seal off the one. Okay. Floor. Like that. And then we're good, and then we're good. So now, now I don't care about the depths. <laughs> that's all I really cared about. Um, so now let's do a pasture here. I'm going to move them in even before it starts to... No, that was a stockpile. Uh, a pasture. It's already even here. Okay. So I'm going to I'm gonna assign them in here even though uh, we don't have stuff growing quite yet because I don't want them to get attacked by an owl or something. And I'm going to shut up with a bunch of birds. Very, very cool. Um, yeah, you can all just go in here until we get some nest boxes done. Um, but now we're, now we're digging for, now we're digging for fortress stuff, right? Um, so let's go... When, where was our, our... Our aquifer is literally just, like, right there. I mean, okay. Um, we're gonna go like this. I'm gonna say, here's our, here's our start. Um, and then I'm gonna go like this. And like that. And then like this. And like that. And then like this. And like that. And then like this. And like that. And that's probably enough even, right? Uh, one, two, three, four, and five, realistically. I mean, yeah, that's, that's probably plenty. I'm going to do like just a little bit of extra for the sake of being paranoid about things. Uh, 
Um, but then, yeah, now we're now we're at cave stuff. So that should be plenty. That should be plenty. Yeah, look at that. So our, our food stuff is going to be on the lower side of this because I want it to be closer to the caves, right? Because that's where we're going to be mining all of our junk. Right, and that's all that's all fine. Yeah. So let's do our I guess they're they're good there. I'm gonna put dining hall and all of our food production is gonna be at the bottom, right? Trying to think of how how's this gonna work. We're gonna end up with we're gonna have our waterfalls on the outside here. Um, so it's probably just gonna be like this. And that's gonna be our dining hall. And then our food stockpile. And then our food workshop should go above that. So that our food stockpile can just go out that way. Because that uh, this is that's gonna be huge by the end. Pretty sure. Um I'm gonna put that there just for my own reference so I don't do something bad. Uh, but then this is going to be our, our lever room. And look, we're finding lignite. That's very good. Uh, and then that'll, that'll give us a place to start putting things. And then, and then what? We're going to want our workshops are going to be here. Do I do the same? Hmm. I'm thinking about this kind of backwards from how I usually do it, so I'm trying to make sure my my brain's doing it right. I think we do want our stockpile here. Um, right, and then we're going to end up with waterfall there. And then, like, all of this area in general can be used for workshops. But I want to do those little 4x4 four four squares again. Because I liked those. Uh, so one, two... So let's do, like... Not here. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Like that. Start with that. Should be plenty for just the food stuff, my goodness. Um, right? I mean, that's a. No, I kind of want to go in this way, don't I? I want to go in like this. say we have stairwells that go like that okay I think that works and then we'll need room for all of our uh, all of our egg layers and that can just be like around here. 
even do hmm I don't want it connected don't I I'm just gonna do like this this is our egg room okay you all dig that you're still still leaving stuff on the ground people um, but there's all of our turkeys why aren't they in the place I told them to be in it's a meeting area not a not a pasture but we are getting we're getting stuff okay we're good we're good on we're good on moss that was my main concern crundle there's a there's a crundle why do you have a name it's a named crundle it has killed a named Katie boar. Did it kill? Did it kill someone's pet hamster? That's a lot of crundles. Giant flying squirrel. Hmm. How many of these crundles are in the fortress? Several. Oh my goodness. There's a whole herd of them. Uh, that's cool. They they must have come from the lower one. Yeah, look at all this. Oh my god, we're gonna get swarmed by crundles. Is this gonna be the day where I underestimate crundles? Because they aren't usually a problem, but they also aren't usually, like, in the fortress by the dozens. It's all got closed, right? On this never... I do need that to happen. Before that floods and then this is all this is all good but yeah no one we haven't someone needs to actually do that please hmm yeah I think we just let all the crundles in hmm well uh, yeah okay KV pup found dead our okay but our hunting dog is fighting crundles is that happening currently no where's our hunter hunter is sleeping of course uh hunting dog is fighting crundles okay have at it i mean you're you're tired also weak that's real good hmm okay <laughs> they're all just out on the surface now there's just there's just crundles out in the wild <laughs> oh, goodness okay um I'm trying to think of like the order of operations that we do this in because our hunter is going to have wooden bolts at most, right? Or, okay, so you're making a meal. You need to be just hunting, please. Please just hunt. We have two glass makers. That's real good. Um, and then plant gatherers. Only you're doing that. Only you're doing that. Uh, nobody's planting because we haven't told them to plant yet. You're... Okay. <laughs> yeah, there's just there's just a bunch of crumbles in here. Um, have we we have any bone? I want to know if we can make any bone bolts yet, because I think those are slightly better than wood. Uh, body parts? I mean, we have a bunch of shells. We can't make shell bolts. Hmm. <laughs> oh jeez. Yeah, nothing's gonna want to be in the pasture if it's just filled with crundles. Unless maybe the maybe the rack the, the bull can just kick in some crundles. I mean look, they're What got you? 
Crundle misses the nanny goat. Uh, stray water buffalo kicks the Crundle in the upper leg, and then it, yeah, and then now it's unconscious. Yeah. So they're not that dangerous. They're just here. They're just in the way. Okay, so this is gonna be all of our dining room stuff. Which means we should also be digging out the rest of the stuff, uh, which is gonna be uh, like this. We could do, yeah, let's do like this. And then the rest of our workshops are gonna be here. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. We'll do this is gonna be more like how I've been doing it in the past. We'll do like this. Um, and then that's probably plenty for the moment. And then we're gonna do the same thing with our stockpiles. It's gonna be above and below. Of course now I want to. Similar here, you like this. Okay. Now they'll start digging on all of that. Hopefully, uh, if they can get there. And then now I can say this is our food stockpile, and it's just going to be everything, right? All of our, I guess, not seeds. We're going to keep our seeds in a separate pile. Uh, so food, all except for seeds. Okay. Um, this is going to be our meeting area. I'm going to create an inn, the gilded dinner. Perfect. Uh, we can put in some doors. I did do that wrong. Okay, we'll fix that. Of course. Um... We need like chairs and tables, right? Uh, I'm just gonna do a single, a one-time order, rock brown and rock table. I'll just do 10 of each. That'll be good. And then our food workshops are all gonna go here. Do two stills and two farmers to start with. Or kitchens farming, kitchen, lamb, lamb. Uh, and then we also want a, a butcher and a tanner right next to it. And a fisher. I could just toss in a farming workshop here. That'll be for something. Um, and then I'm also going to put in a work order for some rock nest boxes, and we'll just say 10 of those. Yeah, I just... Uh, <laughs> yeah, let's do that, and let's do that. So this is all getting dug, and then this is going to be for all of our other workshops. So I want a... let's do like a mechanic. I want a stone worker. I don't need four stone workers, let's do two stone workers. And then two crafts. Or someone needs to mine that one, please. 
Um, I'm not going to bother with a jeweler at the moment. I want... Hey, hey, it's fall. Holy cow. Holy cow. I'm just going to check my stuff. A lot of my notes are going to be for the last thing that we did, which was like making a bunch of goblets. So a lot of this isn't going to be the same. Yeah, okay. Oh, and we should get, uh, we should start milking our goats. That's the thing we should do. Uh, but I do want, I'm going to do a wood furnace and a smelter. Uh, let's do two smelters and a forge. Or metalsmith, I should say. Um, and then this is gonna be our furniture stockpile, I guess. Let's so just do them all. Probably enough for the moment. Uh, so I'll come up here and say this no longer accepts furniture or food. Let's get rid of that mechanic and that fishery and that stone worker. Oh, and carpenter. We should make a carpenter. Definitely. Uh, carpenter. Boyer. Uh, yeah, let's make a boyer. going to want more crossbows at some point. Uh, so then you go away, and then we have we have a kitchen, we have a tanner, we have a butcher, we have a stove. Cool. Done. There's still crundles running around. <laughs> there's just there's just a bunch of crundles. Uh, probably have some more beds to place. No, not quite. And now, now everyone should be busy, right? Yeah, except for our hunter who is socializing. Um, yeah, you're you're socializing with your hunting dog. Cool. Or no, I want to put this on the other side. say like here good enough uh, okay do we have any nest boxes which are workshops yeah nope okay uh, but our food is showing up here that's good. Um, oh, and mechanisms. I should tell them to make some mechanisms. Okay. Um, and then this... Oh yeah, this is all going to take forever to actually get dug. That's fine. I mean, hmm. Mining in the caves are cool and all. Um, oh, our... Our traders are already here. My god. We are already behind on everything. Um, although it's a grim reminder of the winter hardship to come, supply caravan from the dip ceiling is a welcome sight. Um, yeah, we don't even have a trade depot. Can we still build one? Or are they just gone now? That didn't take long at all, did it? I'm... Holy cow. Trade Depot. 
should have built that first thing. Um, like, so, so farms built in here. I mean, it's not given a warning like it's not ideal stuff. Maybe we don't do the... Because it's going to take a minute to just seal off the the cave, right? To make that safe? Why don't I just... Like, this is all this is all aquifer, so maybe not this. Um, but this is loamy sand cavern floor. This might be fine for farming in. And if it is, then we should do that, right? Um... Like, I think as we move these things out, then this is going to become our farm. That's all I'm going to do. Yeah, screw the rest of this. Caves are cool and all. Uh, but it's going gonna, it's gonna to take some person power to get all that going. Do we even have anyone who can build that? Uh... Probably. What are you doing? Our hunter. Okay. Do you have... Do you have a quiver? You just need bolts. You really just need bolts. Hi. Liaison. Hooray. We're all the same as ever. Um, okay. So I'm going to request... Meat. Um, and it's all going to be, like, prepared stuff, but we're going to turn it into, like, roasts and stuff. I wish I could just select the whole category. Or control A. Aha! Okay, thank you, DF Hack. Uh, let's do all the fish and all the plants, because they're, yeah, it's just that stuff, but that's fine. Let's do all that. Um, I won't be asking for those things. And then, and then also some leather. because we will want to be making bags and such, but we'll call that good. Cool, thank you. A need for seeds is expected. Okay, well. We might have some of those. Um, and there's all sorts of things going on already. Expedition leaders fighting a crundle. Ugh. I'm going to build a couple of farmer's workshops in here. What are you all doing? Are you all freaking out because of the crundles? My fight too. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Cool. Um, and none of these things are going to get built because they're all freaking out about the crundles. Uh, I'm going to say this is our finished goods. And then I'm going to call this uh, cloth and leather. And then this no longer takes cloth. Finished goods. And leather. Um, oh, it doesn't need to take stone. It does not need to take stone. Keat has been missing for a week. Oh no. Uh, okay, so now things are getting made. Slowly. Look at all these fish, though. That's good, at least. Um, oh, levers? Right? Machine, lever, blam, nope. Cool. Cool. 
Uh, oh, and this is already like, okay, I need to be, I need to designate the spaces for the, um, the waterfalls. And that's it. Yeah. Why did that? I'm I'm doing real good here. I'm doing real good here. Um, they can get here, right? Those these stairs work. I mean, they were able to dig all this. Hey, look, they're singing. And that's all, yeah, it's all just gonna dream. That's, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. Someone needs to do this though. Oh my God. <sighs> no, not that. I want to go trap, each trap. We don't have mechanisms. Ugh. Uh, okay, so then I could do these. And they're just gonna get single work orders. They're gonna do milk animal. One at a time. When you can. We need a bunch of buckets too, right? <laughs> yeah, these crundles. Hmm. Merchants will be leaving soon. Oh man. Oh, but okay, but you're here. Okay. Now. Can we get our broker here fast enough to at least do the thing? And we're up to 12k. I mean, that's not that bad, I guess. I just, I want, I need a broker to get the XP. That's all I care about. Oh, all these birds. Come on, Kivish. Come on, trade a depot. Okay, Ooh, trade. We're still unloading. Well, that's fair. Um, but okay, so that says we're up to 23k. We're not gonna get a successful trade on, but... Because, like, what do we have? I could... I mean, we have... We have some food. We do prepared meals. Uh... These aren't super... I mean... Their strength is in volume, right? The the miner or the the merchant guards are chasing away all these Kias. <laughs> okay. Hey, oh, we're, and they're still on. They're still unloading. Nope. Kivish, come back. Gotta love when your work computer decides to hate you and lag and lag out both the programs you use the most. It's true. Someone has to deal with these pesky birds. I agree. And now our... Are they... Yeah, no, they're already, they're already leaving. Okay. Whatever. Uh, we have a whole pile of crundle still, and we have some Kias. Luckily, they're just normal-sized Kias so far um but yeah we we need to make cage traps in here so that we can like not have birds flying in especially since we already have crundles just everywhere uh so like all this stuff has been disassembled we just need them to move Move our stuff down here. We're okay, we're making that stuff. 
Yeah, why always with the flies? The migrants, good. Good, good, good. 14, 15, 16, 17, okay. We're up to 18. Now everyone just go move the stuff around. Or smack a crundle. That would be helpful too. Yeah, how did I... I'll have to figure out our waterfalls. That might be my off-stream project. Uh, but okay. Gonna, uh, we're getting all this built. That's good. So now the kitchen stuff can continue. Um, I really want our, our nest boxes. Which, in theory, we have three of them. There we go. Okay, they're they're working on it. They're working on it. Okay, now that we're getting this stuff, um, I'm gonna try to make some some metal bolts, probably. In theory, we're finding iron ore already. Um, I know I'm seeing fuel. Going on to stones. 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 Come on, I know. Hematite, limonite, coal, lignite, platinum. Always with the platinum. Okay, and magnetite. Oh, look at all that! Okay. Okay, we're fine. Um... I'm going to say this is going to be for iron ore, uh, limonite, magnetite, hematite, and this is going to be for fuel, right, stone, lignite, and coal. And then our bar stockpile can go up here. And that's just going to be all the bars and blocks. That should be fine. I'm going to put in oh, some work orders for fuel. I'm going to say uh, charcoal. I'm not going to make the mistake of last time. Uh, we'll just do two. And I'm actually going to make this a, ref uh, a repeating thing, but it only triggers when Coal is less than like five. Uh, but then also a lignite and a coal. When coke is less than like 50. Greater than two. And then same thing. Oak less than 50. Coal greater than 2. And then we'll do iron. Or we have to do all three of them, right? Um, hematite. Limonite. And magnetite. Two, two, and two. Uh, and I want to keep, yes, yeah, ten iron bars is fine. This can be two, this can be ten. Sixty-nine drinks, nice. Must have been very temporary. <laughs> um, 
right? 10, and then this is gonna be two, and that's gonna be 10. Is that how I did it? Yeah. Okay. And then we're gonna make iron bolts so that our hunter can actually start doing stuff for us. Um, amount of iron bolts. Right, so I want like two iron bars. Uh, I guess I want 10 fuel. And then like a hundred iron bolts. Okay. At the very least, we will start making iron bolts for our hunter. And then we will have <laughs> uh that will be all set up for when we get to the point of doing the other things. What's all this? What is all this? Our bro- our, our caravan left us a bunch of stuff. There's just a bunch of books. Our, our caravan... Items being traded. Because they left, right? I thought they're they're already gone. Merchants have left. Nighty night. Thanks for hanging out. Um, sorry if I didn't if I missed your message. Um, yeah. Uh, thanks for hanging out. We're gonna keep doing this. We're gonna keep bashing our head against this. Uh, stuff's getting moved. And then we're we're getting there. We're getting there. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Look at this. Okay, they're already working on coke, uh, and they should be working on food. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. We're just gonna we're gonna be making so much food. And here's okay. And then I'm gonna say uh, a pen pasture goes. Here, I'm even gonna assign all of the egg layers directly to there. You all get in the closet and lay me some eggs. Alright, that's all our egg layers. Then I come up here to our to this pasture. have all, all of our goats and we just have some dogs and then there's that water buffalo okay perfect and then in theory yeah they're gonna start milking and i'm also gonna put in a cheese order how about that how about i do yeah let's do make cheese it's also gonna be one at a time anytime we have anytime you have a milk item you make a cheese item. How about that? Uh, and then, yeah, I'm mostly just waiting for this all to get cleared out so that we can start making farms here. Uh, but clearly we're okay on on food as, like, you know, feeding ourselves. We're up to 25k uh, wealth already, which hopefully isn't, like too small of an amount for our, our next year's worth of stuff, you know? Um, but it is what it is. We'll see how that works. A Keet has been found dead. We are still fighting Crundles on the surface. My god. Um, our, our new arrival here is just stuck out here fighting the Crundles. Hmm. It's just crundles on the surface now. This is not where crundles belong. Who ever heard of a surface crundle? Did that ever get closed? I guess I should make sure we're not just letting in more crundles. Yeah, I mean, this is all... this is all fine. Okay, that got carved. That's good. 
sogar ein Flooding. And then this must have, yeah, so that got sealed because it's, because it's flooding. Cool. We're good. We just have to deal with the crundles we have. Uh, and then people are having no jobs. We have, oh, our miners aren't doing anything, of course. Uh, in which case, just dig, just dig. do we need space for? I mean, we're gonna have to dig our um, our waterfall stuff, but I'm gonna wait just a moment for that, I think. Claimed by, claimed by, okay. Uh, we have more, we have more. Perfect. Hunter is hunting. Are you succeeding? Walnut wood bolt. I must withdraw. Oh, look at all the things falling. Hooray. It is autumn. Okay. Grabs the crundle. Our hunter will take care of them eventually, right? Once we get some, once we get those iron bolts going. And look, all this stuff is happening. It's just, you know, amid the crundles. What are you? You're. Are you us? You're like our our merchants are just standing here. I have bugged out our for our, I bugged out our merchants. I'm probably just gonna disassemble the trade depot. I'm also gonna go grab some water. I'll be right back. Perfect timing. Look at that. Um, yeah, let's let's disassemble that. I guess. I mean, you just make a second one right next to it. <laughs> All this is still. Maybe these are just seeds, even. Uh, okay. So then all that got dug. I'm going to start saying, let's do some farms, uh, which is a workshop. Three, four, five. I'm going to do little five by fives. Three, four, five. Uh, and let's start with that even. I'm going to say our, our miners. We have three legendary miners, that's cool. Um, I'm gonna unlock them from that. I don't know why... Some of them are like locking themselves somehow. The miner's the only one I want restricted. Um, and we have... Let's say like three people gathering plants. Um, our one fisher and our one hunter. I think that's fine for now. I think that's fine for now. Um, but oh, we want a we want like a seed stockpile, uh, which can go. <laughs> let's just put it here. They don't need to be. They don't need to be big. Uh, so food, seeds, all. Yeah. Yeah. Look at what we're... Oh, yeah. Yeah, look at all these milk buckets. Perfect. 
Um, oh, and we need to we need to not cook all of our booze, right? That's a thing. Um, let's see. Let's see this wine. Let's say the wine doesn't get cooked. I can cook the other things. And then how's our how's our labor now? Everyone's doing stuff. Okay. And you're you're just gonna be stuck. Hmm. You okay there? Oh, and our stuff freezes. Oh, the sec the the so the south half freezes. Interesting. Hmm. Good to know. How do I unstick you? Seriously injured, unconscious. This person might just die out in the field, which is unfortunate. Um, yeah, okay, so then the merchants left. The opossum. Oh, but I'm seeing iron bolts, flying iron bolts. Where's our hunter? I want to see our hunter. You grabbing bolts? Grab a, a stack of 25 exceptional iron bolts. Excellent, and now you're eating something. You're eating a celery roast. Deer blood splatter. Cool, and now you're hunting. You say unfortunate with a big smile. I'm getting missed messages here. I mean, it's dwarves. Oh, look, there's deers. We just have straight up deer. Cool. And you're gonna and you're gonna kill it. Maybe. Can you kill a deer? There's the hunting dog. Oh, cool. And he ran off. That was weird. No. Okay. The dog killed the deer. Good job. Does the dog... And this is not even... Oh, it is the hunting dog. Okay. Uh, Vutok. Good job, Vutok. But then, yeah, that's gonna get butchered, and then we're gonna make stuff out of it. Perfect. You're all gathering stuff. Um, yeah. Oh, and we, we definitely need to do our, our cage traps, right? Let's do, 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 boop. And then uh, come down to our levers which are not placed yet. Boop, boop, boop. Um, yeah, look at all these raw mussel roasts. And there's there's just a crundle in here. Can someone please... Is this crundle gonna get owned by all the birds? The stray dog scratches the crundle. Uh, the broker kicks the crundle. The broker attacks the crundle. Okay. Um, well, look, we have all these puppies, so we should set up a, an animal training zone so we can train the dogs. Get more... Oh, we need to make um, cages as well. Wooden cage. This one will repeat. Not 54. Holy cow. Uh, we want empty cages and logs. And then, yeah, that should be fine. Yeah. Uh, and then, okay, so now we have some farm plots. And these are obviously going to be underground farm plots, so they're just going to... Let's say this one's just going to be... Plump helmets year round. Those are easy enough to to deal with. And then this one can do like I'm not gonna bother with plump uh, with dimple cups. Those aren't those aren't food. Uh, cave wheat is good though. And then sweet pods. Quarry bushes are kind of they require more labor, right? But I think sweet pods we can just use. Let's do that. Um, and then yeah, okay. Look, all of our all of our bags are here. Or all of our um, all of our seeds. Perfect. Now we're also gonna want like above ground stuff. Oh, and it's snowing. I did not realize we were that far north. Or yeah, north. We actually get snow here. I'm surprised. I'm actually kind of surprised at that. Um, these are all empty barrels, right? Oh, now the rest froze. 
interesting. Very interesting. Um, I'm also going to put in a work order for rock blocks. I'm going to say... Uh, we'll do we'll do five at a time, but I'm gonna keep a higher number. Uh, rock blocks less than a hundred. We'll do that. So we can start putting uh, a courtyard up here, and then that'll give us a safe place to do some above ground farming and some bee stuff. Uh, without having to get fancy with our with like an above ground below ground situation uh, but yeah I mean what else do we have to dig uh, we have to dig our, our waterfalls um, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll work on that since since that's a thing I do want right it just goes like this oh, come on Um, I think that's... Right, and then... I'm trying to remember how this works. Well, clearly I'll have to I'll have to fix some of this. That's fine. And we have books. Like we just have a random book. Written portion consists of a 26-page essay entitled "Of Elements of Creation," authored by Geshud Kolilom. Concerns the creation of the first mountain home, then the world. Oh, first the mountain home, then the world. This is a book about the per that time a person wrote a book. That's cool. Uh, I don't actually know that use close is going to be what we want there. And you're already getting some blocks. So then, oh yeah, no, I I totally have already screwed things up, haven't I? Uh, so you you need to be elsewhere, which means we need to be digging more more spots. Uh, three, four, five, six, right. So it's going to go down there, and then we can just do this. We're going to make it as symmetrical as possible. Okay. And this goes this way. Like that. And then... Ugh. <laughs> I did... I... Uh, I keep thinking like, oh, well, I don't need to put in all the designations for the waterfall junk. I'll just remember where I not... I just want to not build. And then I screw it all up anyway. Um, let's put our... Uh, make sure we don't not have stills do that. Oh, look, a bunch of talc. Sure, why not? Uh, just assemble these two. And then this stuff goes... It's gonna be like this, right? Or no, like this. Like that. Some 
Someday I'll figure out the best way to do all this. There we go. And then obviously we don't want an actual stairwell there. And then, and then below here, it is going to drain. I'm even going to co-opt our, um, yeah, let's do this. Let's do something like this. Because this is, yeah. Do like that and then the other one is here but it's just gonna it's just gonna do that anyway um or how about let's even just do like this it's gonna be so messy and i don't care i think that's all the all the spots for the waterfall that's that's the main thing um we still have that uh this no longer has a way to get in um it just needs to i just need to construct a stair construct a stair no I Ugh. Ugh. Okay. And then we need to make some grates, right? Rock grates. Um, I'm just going to put in a one-time order for like 20 of those. And then that will be for making our waterfall junk and then I think we can start putting in designations for our courtyard so I'm gonna say like come up to here we can do we can do that right yeah I'll do this whatever blocks we have it's all gonna be a mishmash again uh, this is probably fine Basically over to, over to the river. I can't build. I can't build over a stockpile. Thirty-one. There we go. Get to work on that. Uh, we're already out of plump helmet seeds. But I, I mean, I don't actually care, right? Oh, uh, yeah, okay, we can... Yeah, that's fine. And we're down to... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> that's disconcerting. Uh, is anyone... Everyone's doing stuff. So let's go to our plant gathers and say you only do that for a moment. And that's a whole thing. This is our this is our plant gathering. Oh, and we should make uh step ladders. Let's do ten step ladders and ten wheelbarrows. And I'm not gonna bother with our silly two-sided courtyard again. I think it, it served a purpose, but I don't know that it's necessary. Um, so I'm gonna have our entrance over on this side, I guess, and then that can so it can be by a bridge for our our rear. All these birds, <laughs> all the freaking birds. Um, how are we on 
crundles. Did we get rid of all the crundles? No. Oh, we have some in cages, though. Oh, we can even train the crundles. It's hilarious. That's a good way to get rid of them, I guess. Look at all those Kias. Um, but like you, you're... Yeah, they're just, they're just in here. Seriously injured, but they're just in here. We're making barrels. So we have we have a carpenter. Yeah, you're working on it. We should probably just have a second carpenter. Let's do that. Um, and then this is gonna be stone workers, right? Let's twip. Four of our stone workers here. And then something else can go here. And then more more space. I'm sure we will need it. To construct a stair. Oh, fine. Building present. Oh my god. Okay. Every once in a while. Construct stair. Probably need more fuel. Um, but let's I guess I never did get it's gonna be this. This is the top of our waterfalls, right? And then the other one is going to be here. And then we want... Right? But <laughs> I guess they can just do... Let's just do this. And we can put it back. Um, oh, and then I want to link one of these up to our gate. Um, in entrance. Link to there. That's important. Oh, what's this? An iron wall? Okay, undo that, please. Masterwork has been lost. It's already spring! And we're out of drink. We have plenty of food, but we're out of drink. Lost a masterwork. Oh, Akia ran off with something. Okay, that's whatever. Akia has stolen a masterwork hazelwood stepladder. You bastard. Uh, okay, just 
please? Please do the thing. I'm even gonna put... I should put a grate here, right? Uh, if we have any. Construct floor grates. Doop. Doop. So no one gets flushed away. You know how we have a tendency to do that? Did you just... I guess that only goes down by one. Hopefully. <laughs> Oh, hi, Crundle. Uh, okay, so then that got dug. Let's do a wall here. So that got dug. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. That needs a wall. This needs, like, two walls. That's all fine, and that's all fine. That's all fine, that's all fine. And then yeah, we just need to dig these obviously. Um, but I think, I mean, do we do this from the... We could do the same thing as last time, just do the uh, aquifer since one, two, three, yeah. That's gonna be the simple option, because it's not gonna freeze. So let's do this. Uh, let's dig. But we would want it. Our, we're gonna harvest our water from from he, this level. Uh, so we're gonna do there and there. Just do it like that first. Who's stealing our stuff? Akia has stolen five celery. Damn you. Crundle has forgotten her training. Yeah, I guess so. Oh yeah, we want a training area. I did, haven't actually made a training area, have I? Uh, but that's gonna happen next to the food, because that's how that works. Um, yeah, where do we do that? We do just an animal stockpile here. Is that like where all our cage stuff will go? I think that will be fine. Come on, people. I... Okay, fine. Be miners for just a little while longer. First, we're gonna... Come on. Hunter's hunting. Needs logs. Oh, we need to chop more trees. Just chop these trees. Fuel. That's, that's the other thing we need to be looking for. Probably out of. What's this? Microcline. There's some coal. Uh, let's do like. Something like this. Okay. 
going to use that level for anything, really. Figure it out? Yeah, okay, cool. Nobody died. It's always nice. Alright, this one's a channel. Perfect. Right? Yeah, there you go. Cool. Uh, so now we just need to put in our are great. All right, these can be whatever. There, and there, and there, and there, and there, there. Some migrants have arrived. Perfect. No, that's not, not there. Uh, in there. That's all of them? That's all of them. And that's just gonna keep draining, right? Yeah, perfect. Cool. Uh, okay, we'll place all that, and then let's check our migrants. All the way up there, cool. There's two. Yak, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. That's not bad, considering we got, like, completely blindsided by our our first caravan. 13 is not bad. Um, has this been... No, not really. There's still all this junk in here. Um, okay, we can move our cages at least. Oh, a petition. The Company of Rose has many members, uh, so they want a Craft Dwarf Guild. Do I even care? I'm gonna approve, but, like... Priorities, people. Uh, this... so this. This is gonna be our... Animal Stockpile? Right, but it's not gonna take the empties. And then our training area will be right here. Perfect. And you're all just doing nothing. Hmm. I want them to, you know, organize all this. That'd be nice. Okay, that's fine. That's all good. That's that's all good. That's fine. Fine. Bring, yep. Okay. <laughs> um, we can say some some guild halls. Uh, go like here. Let's do the one. I'm not going to be able to make it as fancy as they want it to be. Except new build hall. And that was a craft. Ooh. Cool. Uh, and then we could even we just smooth it, I guess. I'm not going to be making all these fancy instruments and statues and stuff for them to be making fancy rooms. They're kind of kind of have to deal with it, aren't they? 
Uh, oh, and I wanted to make a stairwell here, except I have to remove you. Hey, baby! that at least and then <laughs> there's just all these crundles hooray um are there any more that we need to train no giant grackle oh dear that's pretty though look at that thing i like it is it just floating up there it's just hovering that's not disconcerting or anything Um, oh, and we don't have like a well set up. Yeah, you're all you're all thirsty. Mm. Mm -hmm -hmm. I mean, we can make a well, right? In theory. Oh, I definitely want to put grates in here so no one falls in. Yeah. Okay. We want more grates. Rock grate. Uh, and then 10 more is fine, I guess. And then all these other things I'm going to wall in. The wall. I mean, I only need the wall to be there. I just don't want to trap someone in here. But someone, they're going to do it. I'll just have to fix it when they're trapped. good enough at engraving to make that happen everybody does this oh we ha we have a legendary engraver holy crap uh yeah you do that then go for it um and yes we need fuel we need fuel uh here auto mine that i'm um, even just gonna do like um, because we're because we're on a four x four, this level's gonna be huge. So I'm just gonna see what we can find. Yeah, look at all that. So much room for activities. Yeah, wow. Cool. Um, and I don't want to connect those. Let's just let's just move all that back up. And then a bunch of jet. And then a bunch of lignite. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Let's just let's just mine all of that. And that's all shirt. Cool. That's that's some fuel. Should take care of that. Um, and then. We're not chopping our wood. Who's who's slacking on our wood chopping? We just need not our expedition leader. Uh, here, you two. And then I'll let's say make iron axe. No battle axe. I'm just gonna do two of those. Um, and then I'm going to get rid of this entirely. Because this is going to turn into our wood stockpile, right? I'm going to say wood on. Bars and blocks off. That's That should have been turned off. The animals off, except for the... I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll make a different place for the empties. Okay. Uh, um. And then, and then what? 
let's do... Nope. I'm gonna say this is like our empty cage stockpile. And then we're gonna need a spot for all of our military stuff at some point. Oh uh, yeah, perfect. Perfect. And then we need a well. Clearly we need a well. Um, we're not... We're not brewing anything, right? We're needing brewable things. Oh, I did fruit twice. That's a, a problem. Let's do brew from plant, because that's going to be what we have. Um, and now I want this to be like... of milk. Does milk not count as a as a drink? We'll go drink from a river, but not from a goat. Uh, okay, so then fermentables and containers. Right? And then how did I do the fruit one? Something like that. Yeah, okay. So now, yes, please... Please brew the actual things that we have. That would be appreciated. Uh, okay, and then waterfalls. We have... We're all good here. We're 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 good here. You're already... Have we, have we satisfied? Hey, look, it's been satisfied. Wow. Thank you. Someone's just in there socializing. Cool. Well, there's coal back here anyway. Um, but here we're good. Here we're good. Hi, Crundle. Here we're good. And then that all just drains. Perfect. Okay. So now we're ready to do waterfalls in earnest. We're just gonna dig out the rest of this. Oh, and there's, there's a coal in here too. Hilarious. Uh, but we just need to dig out enough of the area around our our little grates here that it that enough of the aquifers going into our waterfalls, and then we're good. And then we just have waterfalls forever. <laughs> if it works the same as our lab fortress, I should say. Hey, a strange mood. Hooray. It's going. Gonna take a second to fill, but it's going. Waterfall's done, I think. 
we'll, we'll keep an eye on our mood. Uh, but yeah, there, and then there's a bunch of, there's a bunch of coal. There's a bunch more even. Uh, really don't want to run out. And then, hey look, hematite. Gold. We're just ignore the gold. And okay, now we're back up to 80 drink. Perfect. Uh, what, what kind of drink are you making? Rum. Uh, oh, and millet beer. Okay, that's fair. Uh, let's... Let's say these don't get cooked for now. I do want to have a bunch of drink on hand, right? We don't want to be running out. Um, and then we want a well of some kind. Does this count as a cistern? This flooded stairwell? Do we just call this our well cistern? I think we can do that. Uh, we would just we would channel out there. And it would be not convenient. Hmm. We want it like over here. Or even. Yeah, how do we do that? So we're. I think that's the last thing I need to figure out about this about this situation, the, the waterfall situation, is how to act, well, like, where does the well actually go in a way that makes sense? Hey, look, some caged crundles. Um, are these new? No. So that means we can go here and we can say, um, you should be a hunting dog. Why not? Or even uh, a, a war dog. Let's just make some war dogs. Yell our goats. And then, uh, yeah, we're gonna butcher these three crundles. Or slaughter, sorry. And then the rest of you are fine. We could even, like, like the, the water buffalo? I mean, they make, they make milk, right? And the yak? I guess they can stay. Like a donkey? I don't know what we care about a donkey. Let's just cook the donkey. Glass maker has been possessed. Oh dear. Uh, well then, let's make a glass furnace for the one person. Okay, glass furnace can go there. Hey, look, it's summer. Holy cow! I mean, at this rate, I mean, if we could. Jeez, if you can do Metro Metropolis in three years and do a year and a half in in three hours, then that means you could do three years in six hours. Could we turn this into a six hour speed run? Then we're now we're getting into the territory of like a thing people might actually be interested to watch. I would I would want to get closer to maybe like four hours total, which would be a heck of a sprint, but like we're in, we're in the neighborhood, right? Um, I'm also going to make a kiln while we're at it, because someone's just going to be like, where's my thing? Um, and I'm sure we're missing stuff here, right? Um, we should do leather. That's what should go here. And then uh, we'll make a clother for same kind of reason. Someone's going to want one for a strange mood. And then a loom. I'm not going to bother with a um, dyer. No one cares about a dyer. Uh, and we have, so we have glass kiln. We have smelters. We have a metalsmith. Um, an ashery? I don't care about an ashery. I haven't been worrying about soap. Boyer Carpenter. 
crafts? Did I make crafts? Nope. That's what I'm missing. Year and a half without a craft shop. How about that? Cool. Uh, and then we can even... We're gonna want more, I'm sure. I guess we just do like this instead? It's just all gonna be catty corner? Whatever. Um. Oh, and then we need. Yeah. And these stockpiles already need to be bigger, that's fair enough. That's a thing we can do now. I think we have some of the crucial things done. And the great thing about just doing this as, as food is like, we have that, uh, the workflow is going, right? We don't need to be, like we just need to be bulking it out. We don't need to be making a whole bunch of new stuff to get our industries going. They're already going. Uh, we probably want, like, wheelbarrows and such. I don't know how... How many of those have been made. Um, yeah, I'm even gonna make this bigger, right? The wall. Now, again. <laughs> no. Build. Construction. Wall. Select. I like this. Yeah, they were just going to do more iron. We already have 58 iron bars. We should start making steel. We should already start making steel. Okay, and then we want a bridge, right? Um, I guess let's make our wall first. Let's do one, two, three, and then here's our outermost wall. And then we can say they enter up here. Uh, and then we do... There's going to be one, two, four... People, and then one, two, three. I think that's what we do. Then here's going to be our trader entrance. And they just want to come down. I want to get the traders, like our trade depot is going to be close to our food, right? There's a thing we can do. Uh, but let's do a bridge like this. And then also... Is that even necessary? I could just do...
I want there to be cage traps after the traitor entrance. So I'm going to do another switchback, I guess, right? Do like this. Get a little choke point in there. I don't know if that's actually a good thing or a bad thing. I guess we'll find out. And then we can put some cage traps in here. And then we put our, our gatehouse up here. And then we'll have our wall. And then I think we're good. And then we want a bridge across the uh the the water something like this well cool. and then let's do some cage traps Even do like boop boop. Cool. I mean, this is coming together, right? And that's that's got our roof, and then of course traders can't get to our trade depot now, and and they're going to be showing up any minute now. In, in the fall, but that's not too far off. Um, so I'm gonna do I'm gonna do some planning, but let's do that, and then that, and then that, and that, and that, that, that. Are we gonna get lucky here? Almost. Wow. And then we're here. Yeah, look at that. Perfect. And then we can drain into there. Why not? Yeah. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work just fine. I just want to put a wall here, but that's totally fine. I can even dig around so we maintain that little thing. And then I'll do a wall like this. Not use closest. Right, and then that's all. That's all good. And then we're gonna say this comes like this. And then the trade depot itself is where it's like over here maybe we say it goes here one two three four five one two three four five whatever <laughs> and then that goes there and then our uh let's do like i do want to put in a chicane of some kind like that Perfect. And then the inevitable water will just go like this. And I'll just put like a wall right there. And then we'll be good.
Grendels have been slaughtered, hooray. Uh, oh, you claimed a glass furnace, but uh, we don't have any glass for you, do we? Gems shining. Oh, we don't have any. I haven't been cutting gems. I guess I should cut some gems. Workshop. Uh, jeweler. That's fine. Literally cutting gems just for the strange mood. <laughs> Glassmaker's gone berserk. I was too slow. I was too slow. Uh, oh jeez. You're just gonna straight up go... You're gonna go off. Who are you fighting? Fighting a clother? Glassmaker's bled to death. Well... Hey, look, some migrants. <laughs> uh, it was Inod that went berserk, right? Yeah, okay. I mean, good lord, Inod. Glassmaker misses the clother. Clother punches the glassmaker in the arm. Wow. The glassmaker started this fight, but the clother finished it. Holy cow. You picked the wrong fight, my friend. Well, there's death number one. Failed strange mood, I guess. That's that's not too surprising. Uh, here we go. Yeah, look. Oh, and then they're going to cancel here because... Because of course they are. Um, and then we're just gonna we're gonna need um, coffins. I'm just gonna say ten, and hopefully they can dig this before it floods, because I'd be grumpy. Cool. And then we can say build a wall grate right there. And then we're good. And then we're good. Is everyone standing around? Not everyone. Actually, we're doing pretty good. We're doing okay as far as labor goes. Um, I can probably just make some more kitchens and have them all... Do we have a bunch of plants that aren't cooked? Plants. Not really, even. Wow. Cool. I'm still going to make one more kitchen. Just plop it there. Um, even We could even do like two more brewers, right? Why not? Because you can only have as many people working on a thing as you have workshops for the thing. So to make things work more in parallel, you just have to have more workshops. Um, and then where do the tombs go? Also, they're all going to use this entrance, which is not the entrance I want them to use. Uh, but we'll just we'll just close this when it's done. That's fine. And we're up to 43! Hooray! Look at that. Um, and then where does that put us? We should be making we should dig some tombs. Uh, those can go here, why not? Uh, Something like this.
I meant to make this a little bit larger. Didn't seem to matter that much. Uh, and then this should probably get larger. Just to... Yeah. Um, and this is our, our moth. What else is upstairs? I know we haven't actually moved all of our stuff. Uh, oh, in the cages. Oh, this never... Oops. Duh. Might have gotten some more friends, right? Just a bunch of dogs. Uh, here we have a yak, bull, and the sow doesn't need to be bastard. Uh, but it can be, right? Because then, because you can milk the pigs. I think. Well. We need more beds. Say ten more beds. I'm, I am going to do just uh, a dormitory, though. I'm not going to actually make them bedrooms. Uh, okay, so then this is an animal stockpile, but just for the cages. And then... Yeah. And this can go away. See, so yeah, look at all that. I mean, we're getting waterfalls, right? Hmm. Of course, they're going to spend more time like in this corner, so they might not. I mean, it fills. I guess it fills up all that area. I guess we'll see how effective this is. But if it needs to be stretched, like we, use, our ramp used to be like over here, like two over. So I wonder if that'll that would bring them through the waterfalls themselves more frequently. But this seems to be fine. How about you? I was close to a waterfall. I was close to a waterfall. How can someone be so consumed by hate? They weren't by next to a waterfall. Okay. Uh, oh, and we should get- we can get steel going, right? Uh, I can just do pig iron. And steel. Uh, make steel. Bars, yeah. And then we'll just have to mine out some... Uh, some marble, which I know that we've seen. Pig iron. Uh, yeah, and then iron flux coal. I think that all works. And then same thing here. Steel, big iron flux coal. Mm, greater than five. And then I want to have like maybe 50 steel on hand so that we can make like just a big batch of armor and stuff. It's usually how it ends up going. So yeah, start making steel. We will need it by the time you are done with all that. Yeah, okay. Look at us. Look at us. I mean, this says 24,000 wealth, but I imagine it's a little bit higher. Um... Really, the, the metric we should be going by is, is everyone doing stuff? And you're mostly doing stuff. Um, since we have our above ground courtyard, then we should make above ground farms. Because that'll be more efficient than all these dwarves running out to grab stuff, right? Uh, so let's do farm, farm plot. Um, and then, yeah, I'm just gonna say like, one, two, three, four, five. And these are all going to be irregular because there's all this stuff on the ground, but I, I'm i okay with that. Let's just do that. Let's do that. We'll start there. And then we can also make... How about this? How about let's do rock hive. 
Let's do 10 of those. Is that a... It's a bush tit remain. Okay. Um, we can do, like, any of these. Uh, millet. Millet is good because that's beer and... Uh, hold on. Beer and flour, right? Um, let's say, can you just do millet year-round? You will do millet year-round. You will do... Bilberries. Bilberries sound good. Because that can make booze for sure. And then you... I don't know what you want. Uh, we can foxtail will also be good for for flour, right? And then chicory, potato. Oh, potato! Everyone loves a potato. Potato. And then the seeds for all of those are gonna live here. It could be a Add closer, but I think that's fine. Um, and we have cave wheat and stuff going here. This is mostly a wood stockpile. Let's just do like this. Okay. And the, the milking is happening. Uh, we should link some of these levers and such on oh, place tombs. here. Probably need to place some more. Uh, this is going to be uh, port yard entrance. And then this is going to be a uh, river bridge. Them all. They're just all planting all this stuff. Oh my god. At some point, we're just going to end up with so many farms that we're not going to be harvesting off the ground anymore. We're just going to be farming so much stuff. That's my goal here. Um, oh, all the shells ended up there. That's fine. And now it's autumn. My god. Yeah. A year. Well, I guess we start in a uh, part way into spring, but like part like halfway into the first third so we've basically done a year and a half in three hours and 15 minutes and that was with me you know hemming and hawing about some stuff we could we could make this quite fast i mean we're i'm working on making it fast but we this this has the potential to be quite a quick thing Uh, is anyone... Here, look at this! Everyone's doing stuff. Um, I'm also going to say planters. Uh, we have we have a legendary herbalist. And a, but a, a proficient a proficient planter. I'm going to say... No, I want everyone to... Mm. I want some people to get good at farming, right? Expedition leader, no. You stay inside. Glassmaker, no. Uh, and woodcutters, and and that herbalist. And broker should stay inside. Broker shouldn't even be a woodcutter, realistically. No, 
Now then. Um, and we probably, we're probably low on bags. We're probably needing bags in a, in a bad way for all of our seeds and, and junk. Um, didn't we end up bags? We do have some sandbags, so we should make like, I'm just going to make a, put a, um, a green glass job on, on repeat. How about you make me, uh, jugs. Jugs are good. We're going to need jugs. Make a green glass jugs until you run out of sand, and then those bags will be useful for other things. And then, I don't know if we have any actual leather. I know we've been killing some things, but I don't think we have that much leather. Uh, tanned hide is what it is called in here. Lamb, we have two. Cool. We, we still have a giant squirrel. We've caught another crundle. <laughs> We're slowly catching the crundles. Oi. Okay. Yeah, look at all that. Okay. So. And our mood is doing okay, right? It's it's on the ups, I think. Are you missing anything else in here? I'm sure I'm forgetting something. Oh, we should actually. I'm gonna put in. Oh, hey. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna say cut gems, caravan, hooray. We didn't get any elves or humans this year, but we also didn't have nearly as much wealth at the last caravan, so I guess I'm not too surprised. You, need, you do need to hit some threshold before they start showing up. Uh, but, theory, I also want to link that, don't I? Oh, look! A crundle in a cage! <laughs> uh, broker requested, please. And then I'm gonna say we're just gonna move... What about this? Just move... Just grab a bunch of cheese. I guess it's not that. Only worth 10 each. Uh, let's do... Prepared meals. Look at you! A thousand! A thousand! A thousand! These are stacks, right? So, you know, it's <laughs> prepared a stack of 24 crundle lung roast. But the fact that we cooked a stack of garbage and made a thousand value. Look at these. All these goat cheese roasts. Yeah. Perfect. Diplomacy. Discuss your situation. Okay. Um, I do want... I probably do still want some leather. Uh, but then I'm gonna say... Right? Meat. All. Fish. All. Plants. All. Vegetables. All. Done. Okay. Okay. You want figurines? Well, too bad. Okay, just out of curiosity, it says we're at 26k. I say trade. Now it says we're at 56k. Very, very good. Very, very good. So we do have some some leather. I guess let's let's just do all that and let's see how much stuff we can get. Um okay, two two boxes of leather, okay. Nah. Can I get all your stuff? I can get all your stuff. Why is that a loss? What is so expensive in here? 
Is this just a huge bin? This is just a huge bin. Fair enough. No, oh, okay. They did bring me a caravan full of food. That is what I asked them to do. And then some strawberries and a couple of fish. Okay. Uh, oh, like jabber tripe. Cool. Um, but I'm just gonna have to like deselect some of these. My goodness. Too green. Uh, let's just try that. Uh, we're trading 3,300 for 4,400. No. There we go. There. Cool. That was a trade. And now all that food is going to go here, and then we're going to cook it, and then we'll be good. Perfect. And cheese and stuff. Fishery butcher. Yeah, okay. Another strange mood. What do you want? You're an herbalist. Our plants. We're making plants. Uh, claim to stone worker. Probably easier for us to do. We'll probably have your stuff. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh. And you've cut a bunch of gems. You're probably good now. Let's... We just want to have some gems on hand. Uh, we traded? Yeah, okay. Um, and then like... Okay, so we're... I'm gonna... I'm gonna wrap things up here. Uh... But I think we're in okay shape here. Uh, next, next things are you know security, military stuff. Um, so we'll get uh, a, a couple of squads going. We'll get our fortifications on our walls going. Um, we'll get some steel gear going. A magnetite kern. Oh look, perfect. Um, except it's a kern, not a millstone. So thanks. Um, the incinerated sack? Is that what we are? Is that what our... our, uh... Our site government is called? The incinerated sacks. Or the incinerated sack. Just the one. Cool. Thank you. Um... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and then our, our hives. We can make honey and stuff. Uh, we should definitely make those since that kind of takes a minute for them to start working. Hive. Um, I mean, they can just go like... Right? Why not? I haven't even made all the ones I asked for. Oh, they claim they have. I'll just ask for more. Ten more. Probably sitting in some workshop somewhere.
Well, this is coming together. I think... I think this is gonna work. I am curious to see how... I mean, we're already halfway to, to how fast our previous fortress completed this, so... You know. Um, but we, we are at 58k, so we should get some decent sized... Whatchamacallits, um, migration waves next year. And we just, we just want all sorts of, all sorts of workshops for this, don't we? We already have four stills, um, so let's do like... Some more farmers. We're making all our cheese. And then we're so we're gonna do military stuff and we're gonna do power stuff so we can start doing flower stuff. Flower power. Power flower? And of course we we're just gonna need a gigantic food stockpile. Uh, but we have, I mean, we have wood, right? We should be making barrels. Someone should be making barrels. Someone's working on barrels. Okay, in theory. We have a carpenter. Right. Carpenter. There we go. <laughs> okay. There's so many things that I'm not making right now, but I'm also kind of doing that on purpose, right? Um, you're making cheese. Yeah, we're gonna want... All of this is gonna turn into cheese shops, pretty sure. Uh, did this get connected? No, not yet. Why? Why? No, just do it. Just do it. Everyone's going outside this way instead of going through all the waterfalls. Merchants will be leaving. Okay. They are welcome to leave. Oh, nobles' quarters. We should probably make nobles' quarters. I was just gonna say we can we can take the miners off of just mining, but then I just thought of a bunch of things we need to mine, so we'll leave them there for next time. There we go. Well. Cool. Now I'll just, just go stand in the waterfalls, please. That's linked, and that's linked, and that's linked, and then these. I'm gonna say some of these don't gather products. I already got honeybees in them. They're already all full. Oh my God. Uh, let's do three. Let's do like six of these. We're splitting. this. I mean, people are storing stuff. Um, we're preparing our fish. You're, you're just still here, aren't you? Hmm. Oh, we should have a hospital. Someone should make a hospital. Or I should make a hospital so that someone can come and grab them and put them in the hospital. That's what should happen. I'm surprised they haven't died. Anyway, um, I'm gonna say we're good. Some migrants have arrived. We were at 43, now we're up to 50, 51, 82. 
Okay, so 10 more. 10 more. Okay. Not mind-blowing, but I mean, the the dwarves are just leaving now. So that was like last caravan's worth of wealth draw, I guess. Yeah, okay. I'm I'm just going to keep going if I if I don't stop myself. Uh, so let's let's call this good. I wonder if we can say that we're halfway to victory. That would be That'd be cool. <laughs> I guess we'll see how this works. I am really curious to see if the food thing is any faster or if like the platinum instruments are just worth so much that you can't compete. I'm really curious. Um That's that. Uh let's call that a day. Uh a year and a half in a brand new fortress and we have all the stuff going, right? Thanks for the stream. Yeah, of course. Uh thanks for hanging out. Thanks for being here. Uh thanks for Thanks for being interested in this the weird stuff that I'm doing. You know? Um I'll be back on Thursday. We will be picking this right back up. We will be seeing how how hard we can push this. Um, if we can just... Farms. All the farms. We're just going to have farms as high as the eye can see. And then we're going to get some, hopefully some big migrant waves. And I can just tell them to all like go pick the root off the ground. And then they'll all just brew it into booze. And that's going to be our wealth. And we'll see how that works. Um... So Thursday is going to be more Dwarf Fortress. Saturday is going to be more Solar Ash. That's that was fun. That's going to be more fun. Um, and then and then more more everything. Yeah. Uh, today's episode was brought to you by butterflies. Those pretty things that flutter about and pollinate all our crops and are pretty and things. Um, and by you, clicking all those buttons, joining the Discord, hanging out, chatting, all those good things. Um, yeah, uh, I, I appreciate all that y'all are doing, uh, and, and I'll see you around. Don't forget to stay kind.